another interesting real life application where multiple aspects and capabilities of 5G uh, come into picture is that of CV2X or cellular vehicle to everything uh, communication. The basic tenet of CV2X is to smartly connect uh, cars on the roads with other cars or other entities on the roads as well as uh, the network infrastructure for exchange of a variety of messages catering to different use cases. Uh, what are some of the use cases? Well, predominantly there are four of them and we'll try to take a look at all of them one at a time. The first of which is V2V or vehicle to vehicle uh, communication and it is uh, meant to facilitate communication between two cars uh, that are on the road on multiple aspects such as their relative position or relative speed, their intention to change lane or their necessity to avoid a collision and transmit a warning accordingly. All that is covered under vehicle to vehicle communication along with much more. The next use case is that of V2P or vehicle to pedestrian communication and just like with V2V the focus is primarily on a mutual safety and moreover the safety of the pedestrian or the bicyclists or vulnerable road users as they are also called. So the focus of V2V and V2P is to provide greater safety. The next use case is that of V2N or vehicle to network uh, communication and it is primarily uh, meant to facilitate some real time and or high speed traffic between the car and the network. Uh, use cases may include uh, real time traffic updates, map based navigations, other cloud or infotainment services and uh, your run of the mill software updates that will come from the network cloud. The fourth use case is that of V2I or vehicle to infrastructure and imagine all the roadside infrastructure that we have most prominent of which are traffic lights. Imagine that a traffic light is about to go from green to amber and a car will definitely benefit from knowing that information uh, a few hundred feet uh, beforehand so that it can uh, gracefully slow down and come to a stop by the time the light goes from amber to red and that imparts additional safety to everyone uh, around that car including other cars as well as uh, pedestrians. So that is one use case of vehicle to infrastructure communication and although all these use cases that we have seen uh, definitely make sense on their face there is however an underlying concept we need to uh, keep in mind and that goes back to the different uh, service classes that we saw earlier. Uh, if you connect the dots, you will see that V2V or V2P because they require ultra high reliable and low latency communication, uh, these use cases will be a prime target for URLLC. Whereas vehicle to network communication because it will involve a cloud a computing and communication that requires significantly higher bit rates, that will be more of an EMBB related use case. Whereas vehicle to infrastructure use case will be related more uh, to massive IoT because of the amount of infrastructure uh, involved here. So this is a slide that goes to show you how a seemingly simple use case can have multiple aspects but regardless how 5G as a unifying connectivity fabric is fully capable of not only meeting but exceeding those requirements uh, of different widely varying use cases, not just today, but continue doing so five years and 10 years from now. And that's what I wanted to share with you today as a part of our first look at 5G. We learned at a very basic level what 5G is, what are some of its fundamental capabilities, and what are some of the interesting uh, real life use cases and applications that 5G can facilitate or improve user experience in. I hope uh, this piqued your curiosity and encourage you to learn more on 5G uh, as it did with me and if that's the case, I'll be happy to see you in one of our subsequent Qualcomm Wireless Academy classes. Thank you. Excited to learn more about 5G? Qualcomm Wireless Academy has provided premium training to the wireless industry for over 20 years. We offer 5G training on a wide variety of topics to business professionals and engineers of all levels. Our training is available as live instructor-led classes as well as self-paced e-learning. Go to QualcommWirelessAcademy.com to learn more about our training options and take your 5G knowledge to the next level.